My advice to you would be to develop relationships. Find out who the media is in your community and work with them. You give them information and then they will help you get your message out. As far as uh, radio reporters are concerned is we don't have the capability to get up to a lot of the scenes of fires, so we rely heavily on, on communication back and forth, whether that's using the telephone, whether it's uh, through uh, uh, messages that come across on Twitter or direct messages or text messages, those kinds of things. Uh, newsrooms are so small, they've been all scaled back, so uh, we really need that kind of communication between us and, and the people on the scene and the people back at the fire hall. The best thing to do is avoid officialdom. So for example, structure fire, or the fire broke out at approximately 9.32 a.m. Talk to your public like the way you talk to your wife or your friends. Never, ever, ever try to talk to them in the mighty officialdom because they'll just glaze right over. My tip would be to be accessible to media, get the flow of two-way communication going. If you're at a scene, send a tweet, bare bones information, it's just as important right out of the gate, maybe a photograph. Those are the things. We're under-resourced and we can't get to everything. So if you can feed us some information, we'll report accurate information and that's what the public should have. Be patient with us. We're not all bright.